What's up guys? It's your girl Aries Ashley here and we are doing Vlogmas. That's right. I'm challenging myself and we're gonna have fun. So here we go. Vlogmas day one candle day is coming. It is tonight for App Rewards members as most of you already know and it is tomorrow morning. My store opens at 5 a.m. I plan on being there at 4 or 4 30 a.m. Yes, that's right. We're doing this. We're getting in here, you guys. So I just want to share with you my hoard list. That's right, because I don't feel the need to share my candle day list with you guys, because those of you who know me, and if you don't, hi, my name is Ashley. Welcome to the channel. I appreciate you being here. I want everything. That's right. We, we want everything, right? Most of you want everything, don't you? That's right, I want everything. Am I gonna get everything? Probably not, but that's what I want. So instead, what I'm gonna do, I'm going to give you my hoard worthy list. That's right, these are gonna be the candles that your girl's buying crates of. But before we get into that, let's talk about this candle situation we got going on with everyone wondering if butter rum eggnog is the same as tipsy elf so the buzz on the internet is that tipsy elf is comparable to butter rum eggnog because apparently the packaging was the same packaging from butter rum eggnog but it's a little bit doctored now I don't have the packaging from the year that butter rum eggnog was originally released but I do have this packaging of butter rum eggnog with the Santa on it I want to say it was 2020 that this packaging was released Co correct me in the comments if I'm wrong both of these are unburned and I am going to read the notes and smell them on cold to see if they smell the same. And we're going to start with the Tipsy Elf. That is a very cute packaging, if I must say. And I love the pink wax on this. Very pretty. Okay, so the scent notes are Merry Vanilla, Jolly Nutmeg, a sneaky elf with a heavy splash of rum. Now, the scent notes on Butter Rum Eggnog are Spiced Eggnog, Vanilla Bourbon, Rich Buttercream, sh Shaved Nutmeg with Essential Oils. So, let's smell the Tipsy Elf. Honestly, on cold, I don't really like it. Um, It feels like the rum is like messing with the candle. I don't know. This is something that I feel as though it has the potential to grow on me. Like the more I smell it, then the more I might like it. But right now I'm not a, not the biggest fan. So butter rum eggnog smells different. Like initially I, I get the sweetness from the buttercream in here. Um, They don't smell the same to me at all. This one, I get more rum. This is heavier on the rum than the butter rum eggnog. Yeah, this one, I get more of the... Yeah, I don't... This I guess because this has bourbon. And I do smell the bourbon. But it's not nearly as strong as the rum in this Tipsy Elf. So, yeah, the buttercream in here gives makes this way sweeter in my opinion than the vanilla then that's in this one which isn't bad anyway so if you want to check out my quickie candle review on tipsy elf i'll do my best to link that right there so you can see what i think about this on fire moving right along before i get into my hoarding candles let's talk about my budget because when i get when i talk about this y'all gonna be like girl yeah, so I have a very hefty budget. Uh, however, I am splitting this budget with Body Care Day, so I need to be careful. I'm going to need to be careful because I don't want to spend everything for Candle Day and then I don't have anything left for Body Care Day. So that's something I'm going to have to keep a very close eye on. But y'all, my budget is $900. I know, it's crazy. It's crazy. It's insane. I know, call me crazy. It's all right. It's fine. Um, I do have some coupons that's going to help me just a little bit, just a tiny bit here. I have two of these um, 10 off 40s. 
yeah there we go that's right two 10 off 40s and then I have a 20% off and a full body care so that is going to help me kind of dial it back just not even a lot but just just tiny bit but yes so we're going to do that let's get into these candles first before we start I'm going to tell you the candles that I have already hoarded I have already hoarded blush poinsettia got that burning right there just lit her up not too long ago so she's not quite doing anything just yet um which is interesting because the one from last year like upon lighting bim like beautiful but that's all right because i did burn something earlier you know that's my business i burned something in the kitchen that's that's my business so hopefully she's gonna help me out <laughs> and, and help me fix that but anyway i already hoarded blush poinsettia i am seriously considering getting more even though i already do have a total of five the three i purchased here and the two that i have left from last year and dream bright i don't even know i think i have five dream bright right now i had six but one of them is my mother's so yes i have five and i do believe i have three more on my candle day list so there's that now number one the number one candle that i am looking to hoard on candle day is wine cellar yes that's right i need between six and nine maybe even 12 but we we're not gonna go there because you know body care day right you see what i'm saying body care day is coming i have to remind myself ashley body care day so i want between six and 12 wine cellar i hope i only get six i might end up with nine y'all will see whenever i haul it eucalyptus rain i want between six and nine so good you guys that candle is amazing i have one um if you follow me on instagram you see my my ridiculous november empties um yeah if you don't follow me on instagram go over there pause this video go follow me at aries ashley and you'll see my madness ridiculous i tell you anyway number three laundry day for those of you who have been here you already know i need six more laundry day i need at least six at least six laundry day and i'm gonna leave that at that at least six laundry day number four fresh coconut and cotton y'all it's in a three wick y'all know how much i loved the single wick of fresh coconut and cotton it's in a three wick i'm hoarding it period number five paris cafe i don't like how it comes and goes it, it, it just keeps coming and going and i i'm not comfortable with that i'm not i'm not comfortable with the coming and going so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna grab six i was gonna get four but i changed my mind because of that because it keeps playing peekaboo and i don't appreciate it i want to play peekaboo i'll play with my son all right so i'm gonna grab six paris cafes now let's get into the honorable mentions there were candles that i had four and I was like, you know, there's candles I have three, but okay, that's not really quite hoarding. Four is almost hoarding. And six is, yeah, you're you're hoarding that. <laughs> you're hoarding that fragrance if you're buying six of them. So anyway, really quickly, the honorable mentions. Midnight Snow, I have four of those on my list. Dark Amber and Oud, you guys, it's not on the, it's not on the website. Dark Amber and Oud is gone. And I had that on my candle day list. I started, I started to get four of those during the buy to get to sale and i was like no no just get just wait just wait for candle day it's not on the website y'all so i might not be getting my dark amber and oud and that was like on my top 10 on my candle day wish list which now that all the candle day candles have been released i don't have a top 10 anymore that's it's irrelevant it doesn't even matter <laughs> i just have hoarding fragrances okay so last but not least pumpkin peanut brittle i'm grabbing at least four of those okay you guys so my plan is to shop online exclusives only online i'm going to focus to do the ones that are online exclusives or that i know i'm only going to be able to find online i'll be back tomorrow in my haul yes if you watch this video to the end comment below your number one hoard worthy scent of all time all right, you guys, thanks so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Don't forget to check out my quickie candle reviews on Butterum Eggnog and Tipsy Elf. Ta-da!